So, you've got a taste for adventure too, huh? I must say, the patrons have been in a bit of a buzz lately. Though the topic on everyone's lips is more of an urban legend than actual news. Even minding my own business, I still end up hearing all about it. Uh-oh. It's not one of those scary urban legends, is it? If so, Paima needs to take a deep breath first. <laughs> it's not a particularly scary story, no. At least, not for most people. It's the tale of... The Dark Knight Hero. Ah! Huh? Did the bartender just say something? You weren't even listening. Anyway, the Dark Knight Hero. It is said that he appears in the middle of the night to fight evil and uphold justice. But to be honest, I don't have much interest in such rumors. Unless, of course, he can help take care of the more belligerent patrons after they've had a few too many. <laughs> I would happily take that as proof of his existence. <sighs> I doubt anyone knows but him. Maybe he enjoys being a man of mystery. After all, it's a good way to get the ladies' attention. Any guy in the tavern could tell you that. <laughs> anyway, that's more or less everything I know. If you want to know more, ask around in the plaza. Uh, I need to serve some customers. Dark Knight Hero. Seems like your standard cookie cutter urban legend. But just a little darker. Wonder who it could be. Once you're ready, let's head out to the plaza and ask around. You want to find- Look no further. It's me! I am the Dark Knight Hero. <laughs> You're right, I'm not. <laughs> Jokes aside, I do think that the Dark Knight Hero and I have one thing in common. What's that? It's the way he sticks to his principles. Coming out here, night after night, fighting for justice, keeping Mondstadt safe. Wow, so you're a nocturnal vigilante too? <laughs> no. I just mean he must be seriously rich. Why is that? People only start worrying about spiritual fulfillment once they have enough material wealth. It's the same in every hero story, isn't it? <laughs> no, it's nothing like that. I just have too much time on my hands these days. Same difference. You are the boss of the cat's tail, after all. Why don't you ask the guards at the city gate? They do night shifts all the time. They must know something. You're also here for Mondstadt's wine, aren't you? Come take a look. There will definitely be something that catches your eye. You want to know about him? In fact, I'm one of the few who has seen him with my own two eyes. Great! This is the guy we need to talk to! So, just who is the Dark Knight hero? Whoa! Slow, slow down. Let me start... Well, I was patrolling one night when suddenly I heard something. I, I saw a gang of suspicious-looking fellows who looked like they were up to no good. So I quickly hid. Hid? You're supposed to be a guard! That was when he appeared. He was dressed in black from head to toe, perfectly hidden in the night. The way he crept up on those bad guys. Wow! Guess what I did next? 
I would probably have just gotten in the way as far as the Dark Knight hero is concerned. So instead, I headed to the Knights of Favonius' residence. Correct. I thought surely someone with such a strong sense of justice and who voluntarily protects Mondstadt is exactly the kind of person you'd find in the Knights of Favonius. <sighs> but it seems I was wrong. I checked everywhere, and there were no signs of anyone having left the building. So you're saying whoever it is can't be from the Knights of Avonius after all? Yes. But I just can't understand. Why would someone like that not want to join the Knights? I'm sure they would warmly welcome someone of his abilities. So, the point you're trying to make is, you don't know who the Dark Knight hero is either? Hey, don't be like that. At least by talking to me, you've ruled out a few more people. Anyway, try asking at the flower shop. I heard a girl there's been talking about the time you rescued her. What's wrong with me? Why can't I get him out of my mind? Uh, hello? We'd like to ask you about the Dark Knight hero. My hero? Oh, sorry. Just hearing his name gets me lost. Is it that obvious? Oh no. What am I going to do? If Master D. Luke ever finds out. Huh? What's D. Luke gotta do with this? Uh, well, I guess I might as well spill the beans then. I used to think D. Luke was the one for me. But ever since the time I was rescued by the Dark Knight hero, I... I just don't know anymore. Wowee! You saw the Dark Knight hero? For real? What's he like? It all happened so fast. I was so scared. All I remember is seeing a flash of fire. But I felt safe. I only saw his silhouette, but it felt so... familiar. Who knows? Now that you mention it, a pyrovision does seem like a good explanation. It lit up the whole area in an instant. I remember that very well. Okay then. Well, thanks for the intel, Donna. See you around. So, based on what we know so far, all we need to do is find a wealthy, vision-wielding vigilante who's not one of the knights. Hmm. Nope, still no idea. But we already asked so many people. Guess we gotta see for ourselves. Let's take a look around the city at nighttime. If we're lucky, we just might bump into him. It's getting dark. Let's stick around Monsta. Maybe if we're lucky, we'll meet the Dark Knight hero. <laughs> There's still a long road. Be safe. May the animal arc on. After managing to steer clear of the guard's patrol route, I never anticipated I'd run into you instead. Dark Knight Hero? Sounds awfully derivative to me. Please tell me you didn't come up with that. How is this the first you've heard of the name? Every man and his dog in Mondstadt is yapping about the Dark Knight Hero! I do not concern myself with idle chatter. Though, I suppose I may take the idleness of others as a sign that peace prevails. Huzzah! The great mystery of the Dark Knight Hero of Mondstadt! 
against that. We now then, Mr. Dark Knight Hero. Please stop calling me that. Seriously, it makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> Not surprised. It's the stupidest superhero name Paimon's ever heard. You should come up with something more original. Like, um, Cap Pi. Captain Pyro! Tell us, Captain Pyro, what happened here today? It was the Abyss Order. Them again? I don't know what the devil they're plotting this time. It seems they're performing some initial reconnaissance. Considering that I've proven myself to be one step ahead of them on countless occasions, their persistence is unusual. I assume so, unless you're aware of any other... Dark Knight heroes around these parts. The Knights are, for the most part, an utterly incompetent bunch. I cannot trust them to take this matter over. <sighs> That's not my point. I'm not doing this to impress anyone. Well, I hope this conversation has been of service to you. Because I would like to ask for a favor in return. Oh? What is it, Master D. Luke? Your wish is our command! You must keep my identity a secret. Above all, it is crucial that you do not let the Knights of Favonius know I am connected to any of this. <gasps> What's that sound? Yikes! Have the Abyss Order sent back up already? They appear to just be small timers. You should have no trouble dealing with them. I cannot afford delays on account of a few lackeys. I shall have to let you take care of them. Remember, don't tell a soul. Hey, you're just gonna leave us like this? Greetings. I thought I heard something, so I came to check it out. Did you see anything out of the ordinary? Nope. Nuh-uh. Not here. Nothing. Silch! Unless you're looking for the Dark Knight Hero, in which case... The Dark Knight Hero? You saw him? Oh! Uh... The Dark Knight Hero is... Uh... Her! You! The hero who safeguards Mondstadt from the shadows! On behalf of the Knights of Favonius, I thank you for your service to this city. Uh, it's nothing. Really, you're too kind. W wait a second. Aren't you the traveler that just arrived in the city? Rumors were circulating about the Dark Knight hero long before you ever arrived here. Oh! Why would you lie to me about that? Mm, never mind. You don't seem like bad folks. But I do hope you will visit the Knights of Favonius soon, where we can discuss the Dark Knight hero situation in more detail. Some things are best not discussed in public. <sighs> Duty calls. I must be going. Stay safe, Traveler. You two! Thank you for coming. So, the Dark Knight hero, do you have anything else you're able to share with me? Ah, yes, of course I should fill you in first. Apologies for my appalling lapse of etiquette. The situation is... Mm. Here, take a look at this. Jeez, what horrible handwriting! Indeed. Although this is written in the common tongue, it appears that a cipher has been used in many places. Nevertheless, one can grasp the general message from the non-ciphered portions alone. This is a war declaration from the Abyss Order to the Dark Knight Hero. 
Does that mean the bad guys want the Dark Knight hero to go away forever and ever? <sighs> Something like that. Thus, we are hoping to contact him as soon as possible so that we can attempt to coordinate a response. After all, this matter no longer concerns merely the Dark Knight hero himself. It impacts the entire city of Mondstadt. If you find out anything at all, come and find me. A war declaration sent by the Abyss Order?